Hi guys, welcome to Karen's Corner. I've got a lot of Alice in Wonderland items to show you. I've been searching the internet the last few months actually and I've been finding such really nice treasures. Most of them on a Marktplatz, which is the Dutch auction site, for just, you know, one euro, two euros, three euros and some bit more expensive items. But also on eBay and there's a lot coming in pretty soon. It's also exciting. I love hunting for my collection. <laughs> so one of the items that I found was this one. It is a cross stitch quick and it is one cute Alice in Wonderland cross stitch pattern. And um, I thought it was the whole magazine because there was also uh, a picture of this and you saw 6.95 and I thought it's the whole magazine but you know I'm only interested in Alice and when it arrived it was just this thing. <laughs> I think it was um, free, a free pattern that you got with the magazine, but it's okay because I only need this one. And it was a very lovely lady that sent this to me and um, I'm very happy with it. And I might even try to uh, make a cross stitch of this one day. <laughs> I'm into diamond painting at the moment, so cross stitch will have to wait. But uh, it's just really fun to have stuff like this. I'm going to put this in a binder. I have binder for uh, for stickers and for greeting cards and for all kinds of stuff and this is gonna go in the all kinds of stuff binder <laughs> awesome right next month you have thumper oh but i'm so happy with my alice in wonderland one so then i have a few books <laughs> these i also bought on marktplatz and i'm gonna start with the oldest one it is alice's adventures in wonderland so it's the english version because this one says alice in wonderland but now it says alice in wonderland it's the dutch version Anyway, so I saw this one and it is a bit of an old one. It has, um, it's, it's, it's a bit broken over here, as you can see. And there's uh, some spots over here, but oh well. Then you have a lot of names in here. So a lot of people uh, owned this. It is from 1927 uh, and it was someone in Surrey once and <laughs> There's also, it was also from, I think, Heidi or Heidi Hopkin. <laughs> and uh, they also colored this in with the red pencil that they used for this and for this. <laughs> but other than that, <laughs> it's, it's really, it's really nice. There's no, it's old, but it looks really great still. And it's really fun to have an old edition. So I think I paid maybe 10 euros for this in the end so that was a really nice price and it's just cute i think i'm gonna put this as a background somewhere just because it's it looks it looks really wonderful <laughs> so i like books like this but then you also have books like this it's totally different and this one is is there a year on here there must be it is 2004 <laughs> And it's a Dutch version. It's um, Alice in Wonderland. And you see Alice and then over here you have the white rabbit. And actually that's I think the only picture in here. What? It's a book without pictures. What's the use of a book without pictures? Like Alice said. But So this is the only picture. <laughs> and at first I didn't want to buy it. But then I thought it's actually quite funny. Because it must say somewhere over here in the beginning that uh, her sister was reading a book. Oké, okay, but it says... Maar daar stonden geen plaatjes of spreekteksten in. En wat ben je nu met een boek, dacht Alice, zonder plaatjes of spreekteksten? Oké, okay, this is weird. It said, this doesn't sound right in Dutch either. Anyway, it is the phrase that it says... What's, what's the use of a book without pictures? Well, this is a book without pictures. That's really fun. <laughs> Okay, so I, I just wanted it. Then you have this one. This one gives me a 70s feel. I have no idea. Let's just see. It is the original drawings inside. And it is from... Uh, can I find it somewhere? No, I can't. It doesn't have a year in here. Uh, this gives me a bit of a uh, 1970s feel. I don't know why. It might be from the 80s. I don't know. Anyway. It is a book with... it does have pictures. Does it? Yes, it does. The original John Tenniel pictures in here, as you can see. So is there a year, a date somewhere on the back, maybe? No, the end. 
So it's also a Dutch version, but this one does have pictures. Uh, the fun part of this one is that it has the John Tenniel pictures, but this is totally different. Someone else drew this. I don't know who, because it doesn't say so. <laughs> Maybe inside here. Illustrations, John Tenniel. Oh, and Hans Sturis made this. <laughs> so that's that's these two books are just fun. And like I said, I only pay two or three euros for these. This one was just a little bit more expensive. So books, lots more books for in my Alice library. I've got quite a lot by now. But I have more. I have this one. It is a beautiful mug and I absolutely love this color blue, as you can see. <laughs> um, I bought this at Disney Store UK and had it sent to the Netherlands. But um, unfortunately, because of Brexit, we can't order there anymore. There is a Disney Store Europe, but uh, Alice in Wonderland, they have three items. Oh yeah, so yeah. So I hope, I hope we can order there pretty soon again, or Disney, uh, Disneyland. Disney Store Europe will get more items, because I don't understand why they don't sell the same items. Anyway, this is a beautiful mug. I really, really love it. It is just so gorgeous. And I love Cheshire, although it's creepy that he doesn't have any eyes. But I love it that it has a drink me bottle on it, and I love the way Alice looks over here. Now inside, as you can see, there's a lot of stuff. I'm gonna take it out. <laughs> this I bought on Mark's Platz again. And uh, these are little c collectibles, little gotcha figurines. I have no idea where they're from. Shoko Party. They are by Tommy. Tommy. And uh, I think they are from Japan. I think the person who got these bought them in Japan. I'm not really sure. They were all packaged like this. So this one I still need to uh, put together. And, well, let me show you. First you have this one. It's so small, it won't even focus. Ah, here it is. Look at it, it's a cute little oyster. And I have hardly any oyster merch, so I'm so happy with this one. It's so teeny tiny and so cute. A cute baby oyster. <laughs> and then there's also a white rabbit. Look at it. <laughs> so you had to put these together. It was quite a difficult job, but I managed. And look at him. Isn't it gorgeous? <laughs> with a pocket watch. I absolutely love it. So uh, these were in, uh, I think, uh, gotcha machines. So you put some money in, you turn it around and you get an egg or something. And then inside is, is a little toy. So I've got these two and I've got this one, which is amazing. The walrus. So I need to put this one together again. It is the walrus. <laughs> so it's funny that I have this one and the little oyster, although he's going to eat the little oyster. So that's a bit sad. But... <laughs> I really like it. So there are way more. It's so small, I can hardly show you. Uh, you've got an Alice. Wait a minute. Can you see this? Wait, maybe this will help. You've got an Alice. I've got that one, the White Rabbit. I've got that one. I still need the Red Queen, the Tweedles, or one of the Tweedles, and Cheshire Cat, and the Mad Hatter, and a March Hare. Oh, and then over here you have the Walrus and the little oyster. So I still need one, two, three, four, five. If you have them, please send them to me. <laughs> I do have these four and I still need to uh, put Alice together. So let's do that together with you. I'm gonna open it. Okay, so I can put these aside and then you have these little things. It's, I just love stuff like this. Okay, everything out? Yes. So, I think you need to put the legs in here. Ooh, it's not really sturdy, it's gonna fall out. Then there's a... <laughs> there they go, legs. <laughs> they just fell down. I'm just gonna put them over here. Let's see. Uh, oh boy, this one is not really very sturdy. Oh yes, wait. Most of the time you have a small and a big hole. And it's so scary to put it in. But look, she's got legs. <laughs> Okay, then you have a teeny tiny arm. This one is already in there. This one, it's all so tiny. <gasps> but it stays. And then you have the head. Oh, and then you have a cute Alice. I, I have no idea if you saw what I just did. If you didn't, I will edit it out. If you did, look, 
now it's complete. It's a cute Alice. So I've got four of them and I need four more. And I really want them now. <laughs> but like I said, I love stuff like this. Guys, and then I have this one. <gasps> this is amazing. <laughs> I'm so happy I have this. I've seen this so many times over the past few years and uh, it was just always too expensive. And now I saw one uh, on eBay in the US. So getting it over here is pretty expensive. But um, if you're lucky, you don't have to pay custom fees and VAT because that's just that makes it even more expensive. It's just, yeah, you can't just buy in the US or outside of the of Europe. It's really hard to get stuff over here. Well, you can, but you have to have lots and lots of money. <laughs> so anyway, I saw this for a reasonable price and uh, the seller shipped it to me as a gift. Of course, I had to pay, but marked as a gift and then uh, I didn't have to pay VAT in a whole lot so it was I could afford it so it is so cute and I'm not gonna take these out of the box normally I take them out of the box but I just like this so much the way this looks so you've got this cute little is it Kelly oh Kelly and Tommy look at her it's cute little Kelly dressed up as Alice and then you have the tea party and again you have the teapot and a uh, teacup and I absolutely love that. I'm really obsessed with these, with the tea party teacups and spinning teacups. And then you have Tommy looking really gorgeous as the Mad Hatter. It's just so cute and I love the way this looks in the box. So I'm gonna put it somewhere that you can really, really see it when you walk into the room that you see this. So uh, I can't wait to do that because when you take this out of the box, the table, it's, it's not real. It's just a piece of piece of uh, paper and uh, yeah, you don't have the background. Actually, you just have the two dolls and the, and the cup and the teapot and that's it. So yeah, that's a shame. So this one I'm going to leave in the box just because it's so gorgeous. And it is a Barbie collectible. It is a collector's edition. <laughs> and it looks awesome it just looks awesome so like I said gonna leave it in the box and look at this it's so nice so I was so happy when this arrived and I have a few more items that I bought on eBay that has to be shipped from the US and from Japan and I can't wait for it to get here <laughs> but isn't this gorgeous I'm so happy with this okay oh, can look at it for hours it's gonna really when you walk into my room this is the first thing you're gonna see <laughs> Okay, and talking about spinning teacups, <laughs> I've got a spinning teacup. Actually, I was looking for another one that had a little, it was, it's a little bit bigger and it has a little drawer in here where you can put something in. And um, I was looking for it on eBay, but it was so expensive that, yeah, okay, not gonna happen. But then I saw this one and I saw a lot of them and they were all very expensive, but this one was you know, affordable. Again, from the US and again, someone who didn't mind marking it as a gift. And look at it. It's so sweet. <laughs> I like it so much. Look at them. So they're in the spinning teacup and it's spinning around. And this is a lid, so you can take this off. And it's spinning around and around. And Alice absolutely loves it. The Mad Hatter is, uh, loves it as well. I mean, it, it's mad. It's weird. He loves it. But the March Hare it's going crazy. No, it's spinning around. And I love the fact that Alice's hair is just waving. You can see them spinning. I just love this so much. And the fun part is, first of all, you've got the purple cup with hearts on it. I just think it's amazing. But when you take the lid off, you've got a little trinket dish. <laughs> I've got more to show you. <laughs> I forgot it was in here. Okay, you've got a little trinket dish. <laughs> I didn't know where they were, now I know. <laughs> so um, there's a little bit of felt in here so you can put your little trinkets in here and it doesn't make a lot of noise. That's why I didn't know, know these were in here. And then you can just close it and you've got this. Isn't it awesome? I mean, isn't it insane? Oh, I love this so much. So I'm gonna put this on my uh, spinning teacup shelf and I think it's almost full now. I need I need a new shelf. I need a new room. Now I've got room enough, but it's just, I want, you know, now I have everything really nice and organized and you can see every item really well. But uh, in a while I'll have to start stacking things up, which I also like. I mean, have you seen uh, Prince Otaku Yuri's shelves? Uh, I hope I can remember to leave a link somewhere over here. He's got <laughs> bookcases full of Alice and they're all stacked together because it's, 
yeah, that's all the space he has. And uh, I love it. So one day my room will look like that, but not now. <laughs> Okay, so I've got this wonderful spinning teacup and apparently I've got more to show you. Oh, right. I bought these, I think, also on Marktplatz. I do have a few of them. I'm not sure if I put them with these because I already had the queen. Uh, and I'm not sure if I took them off the, uh, the pin board that I have. I might have bought these all and now have one or two uh, to spare. But look at it. It's all from Coca-Cola. And oops. You've got the Red Queen, which is hard to show. <laughs> and I think cast members had these at a Coca-Cola or at a Disney event. I, I don't really remember. I asked the person who sold me, but I forgot. <laughs> if you know, let me know again. Uh, I think cast members had these uh, for a special occasion. So you've got the Cheshire Cat and you've got March Hare. Isn't it awesome? And you've got the Mad Hatter. So now, as you can see, especially with the Red Queen, you can see that the colors are fading. Wait a minute. So over here it's still a bit white, but over here it starts to turn yellow. That's just because it's old. And uh, I think the, the new pins don't have that, but these older ones, they do. But oh well, it looks nice. It still looks nice because look at this white rabbit. It's still white. It's starting to fade a little, but look at the yellow from the Red Queen. It's... That's white as well. <laughs> but oh well, look at the right rabbit. Isn't it gorgeous? And then you have the Tweedles, which I absolutely love. Look at them. <laughs> gorgeous. And of course, the Caterpillar. Now, I do think I have this one. So, like I said, I'm not sure if I have this one twice now or if it's... Uh, I think I bought the whole set and um, thought, oh well, I have some twice now. And then last but not least... <laughs> Alice. Uh, it's a bit hard to show you. Alice is very delicate. Her face is so cute. I just love these pins. So uh, I bought the whole set and this was, well, I think I think I paid about 40 euros for it, which I thought was pretty expensive. But if you, you know, it's, it's just um, five euros a piece. So that's not that expensive. But I always try to wait and, and search the internet and f you know, just wait long enough until I find something affordable, something uh, that I think, okay, I'm, I'm willing to pay that for it. So these was okay. I thought were okay. This I just bought at the Disney store. So yeah, this is the normal price. This was for a really good price and I'm so happy with it. <laughs> and this was also for an awesome price. And then this I paid a nice price for. And these little ones, I have no idea what I paid, but I know it was... Oops, where's Alice? <laughs> I know it wasn't very expensive. <laughs> so I'm very, very happy with these. This is so cute. And even with the little little um, pieces of paper that come with it. And then I have these three books. Like I said, these were two euros or maybe three. This was ten. So um, yeah, I'm always looking for really nice buys. And that's the fun part of it. Hunting for something. And then you see something you really, really, really want. But it's just too expensive. And you just just keep looking you just uh yeah i think i bought this one for half the price that i saw it first and uh after it took me a few months but then i found it for a reasonable price same with this one so yes i'm very happy with it so what do you like best of all of this it's very hard for me because i'm absolutely obsessed at the moment with the spinning teacups but this one i wanted for so long and it's so cute but these are insane. I've never seen these. I love it. And I love everything. Everything. So, um, but I would love to know what you like best. And you know the drill, guys. I would love a thumbs up if you like the video. I would love it if you subscribe. Uh, if you're an Alice fan, I have Alice videos every Saturday. And maybe sometimes another collection. But most of the time, Alice. And a creative video every Monday. And then every now and then, something in between. So, um, yeah. That's it for today. All that's left to say is... Please subscribe <laughs> and hit the notification bell. En groetjes uit Wonderland. Greetings from Wonderland. Bye.